Hey there, welcome to Conan O'Brien Needs a Friend. Joined as always by my my good pals, yep. Sonam Obsession, uh, my assistant now for how yep. many years? Four, 14 and like a half. Okay. Like, yeah, 14 and a half and years. And for how many of those years did you, do you think you really tried? Be honest. I'm gonna, you want me to be honest? Yeah. Two. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and of course, Matt the Gorley, you two. always give 100%. Oh, what? Did, well. of what you're capable of. Oh, right. Yeah, <laughs> about ten oh. percent yeah. of most people. Yes. Yeah. yeah. You're you give a hundred percent of the ten percent that you're able to give. What's your name again? My name's Cronin. Okay. <laughs> 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 it's nice to be here all together, isn't it? It is. Yeah. Do you like it? Do you like coming in to see me? And I'm not gonna lie. It's nice to like just kind of get away, drive here. Well, you live in a madhouse. I think it's fair Wh to say. Why would you? No, no. I'm not putting you down. I'm you're just right. saying. You're right. No, it I is a madhouse. Any mom who has twin two-year-old boys yeah. who have figured out how to make weapons yeah. uh, <laughs> would probably say that it's nice to come into a podcast studio. I, it absolutely is. Does no, it I know hurt I've to come into two other assholes, though? I It does feel like I'm going... Well, are you saying my children no, are assholes? Came out Wait, wrong. you just that said came other out assholes. Came out wrong. Her kids are not assholes. No, they're not. Don't you play all sanctimonious No, I'm sorry, yeah. but that's not cool. Yeah. No, you're right. I apologize. I am going from two toddlers to two other kind of toddlers. That's what I meant. Yeah. yeah. Two toddlers to two asshole toddlers yeah. is what I meant. That, and, yeah. and so how's your little shithead? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I thought we were into putting people down people's she children. Is. She's she, Well, she's in, really into something called pissy water, uh, oh. which is uh, just seltzer water which she tries to call spicy water but comes out pissy wawa oh. so she all day is going pit, baby pissy wawa baby pissy wawa right oh, yeah child cute. services is going to hear that and yeah me, and they're going to think she has to drink her urine well, that that's, there's some kind of weird stuff going on at your house they say it's good for you yeah i don't think it is pissy water it... no no urine. you lost oh, urine. The track i know no the... that's i thought that i was saying pissy water like glenn says it but you might piss is good for you have I'm not going to drink my piss. You're not? No. Let's all drink our piss right now. Uh, <laughs> sure. On. Okay, I just did. No. And, yo, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good thing it's a podcast and there's no video. Ah, oh, there's video on YouTube! <laughs> or wherever you enjoy your videos. See what I did there? What are you, what do you mean? Leaving room for... Uh, oh, just in case they Pornhub? invent another... In case they invent another format. I just make sure that I always cover my bases. Okay. I'm very smart that they way. They invent and there are other I formats. was saying stuff like this on the TV show back in the 90s. Huh. I was saying, well, you know, I, I hope you enjoy this either tonight or when you see it in a rerun or someday when they invent the internet. Hmm. I remember you saying- You said this. I said that in 94. No. Okay. There's actual tape of it that I was then destroyed. Sometimes I'm, I feel like you don't even know that the internet exists now. Yeah. I'm told it's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> it's not. <laughs> Sure, it's got its pluses and minuses. It's okay. Um, no, I'm very happy. I like coming in here because no one wants to see me around my house. Oh, They're quite happy for me to really? leave. Oh, yeah. What I'm do at they that do stage. when you're gone? Do you I hear a lot of... It's funny. I hear a Mexican band playing <laughs> oh, the minute I leave. You're I mean, brass there section, me. and uh, and and it's weird because there's no band there. Uh, but the minute I leave, and then I see catering trucks pulling up, oh, and I see lots of guests showing up, and everyone looks excited. It's that yeah. song where the Ewoks play when they beat the Death Star. Just that whole da 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 da. -da. This show is sponsored by Better Help. Okay, imagine you're looking at a scale with everything you do for others on one side, and then on the other side of the scale is everything you do for yourself. And the question is, is it balanced? I think in a lot of cases, that's probably not the situation. Well, guess what? Therapy can help you clarify your values, find more balance in your life, so you can keep being a rock star for others without forgetting yourself in the process. To be honest, I've never been a rock star for anybody. <laughs> <I> just, <laughs> but I get the idea. So if you're thinking of starting therapy, I think give BetterHelp a try. Here's the cool thing, it's entirely online. It's designed to be convenient, flexible, and suited to your schedule. So what you do is you fill out a brief questionnaire to get matched with a licensed therapist and switch therapists anytime for no additional charge. And I think one of the barriers to getting therapy for a lot of people is, I don't know, I gotta go in, I gotta sit there with this person, it's gonna be awkward, what if it's not a good fit? I'm gonna feel weird saying this doesn't work for me and not coming back. All of that's eliminated uh, with BetterHelp. So find more balance with BetterHelp. Visit betterhelp.com slash Conan today to get 10% off your first month. That's betterhelp, H-E-L-P dot com slash Conan. I have a question for you oh. that, that you can answer. Is this Star Wars related? Yes, uh, it's, open about, for business. it's about what you just uh, okay. 
brought up. Okay. Which is, I remember showing my son those movies, yeah. and he was, you know, uh, enthralled. And I showed them to him when he was uh, a little boy. He was like, I don't know, maybe he was six or seven. And I showed him those movies, and it was a big deal. And then we got to the one where I remembered the Ewoks doing a dance and singing a song called like Jub Jub or something or Glub yeah, Glub. Yeah. And I said, oh, wait till you see this. This uh -huh. part, man, <laughs> I said this part, I remember seeing this in a theater and this is a little rough, but take a look. And then we got to that part and it didn't happen. Yeah. What happened? Did they edit it in, out? In 1997, Lucas released special editions of all three original films and they did, they added CG and then in Jedi, they took out the song that they sing written by John Williams' son, which is like a disco song called Lopty Neck, and they replaced it with like a blues song. And then they took out that Ewok celebration song and just put in this somber, yes. almost like funeral dirge right. music. Right, so I looked like a fool because I told my son, check this out, yeah. it's really hilarious because it doesn't quite work, where do you see this? And then it didn't happen. What was the song? How did it go? Icha, kunka cha chicha. And then, of course, they've got the curtain call mm -hmm. with old Darth Vader there dead, mm -hmm. but then yeah. they switched it with young Hayden Christensen. Yeah. Yeah. Um, <sighs> yeah. You want me to keep going on, or are you about to say something? Can you no, no. Watch? I was just remembering. I have to go have a heart surgery. <laughs> so I have to leave now, and we're going to have to cut this. Uh, did I tell you that I'm having a quadruple bypass today? No, you didn't. Yeah, but just I switched my mind. The job was no, no, no. I'm also having uh, both eyes removed. Mm. And uh, that's mm. a whole other thing that's uh, happening. Yeah, okay. they're just going to Can you put... watch OG Star Wars somewhere? Yeah, my house. That's but not doesn't, your house? Does, does, uh, I can come over. Does Lucas, it's, does Lucas also, it's okay. does he have a hit squad out trying to find people like you who can sing the song and, just, and, and kill you? Because he probably wants it all erased from people's minds. Too. I don't think he cares anymore because he sold the whole thing. I think he's just oh, been he too still wounded cares. by No, he still cares. Yeah, well, good question. Uh, I don't know, but I've got those despecialized editions, they're called, and high def, if the two of you want to come over, we could have a slumber party, we could giggle, we could tickle each other. You know, we, can you know what them. we can borrow them. Yeah, or yeah. I could say I'm going to come by and borrow them, and just if you don't hear from me, it means I'm coming soon. No, no, no. These are <laughs> these are not physical media. These are, are digital. They're on a drive, so we have to watch them at my house. I'll borrow the whole thing. Maybe well, next year's Chill over. Chump. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh. We do a nine-hour day where we to. watch all three movies. I can't That's be there. Right. I'm having my entire pelvis removed uh -huh. next year, so there won't be a Chill Chump <laughs> next yeah. year. Yeah, it's being... It's being replaced with a just an old wicker basket. Yeah, and I gotta drive him. You gotta drive me. I gotta drive you. And you gotta too. drive That's me cool. home I'll too. And, along. and no speed bumps because I'll have no ass on the no, way home. No, I'll come oh, along I, and we'll get those little DVD players for the back of headrests. Massive ass now. All right, take it easy. <laughs> yeah, it's been said. I don't have much of an ass. Pretty much a. It's a two minute surgery. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, that's nice, Sona. I don't think people have to know just how bad it is back there. You don't think people have to, you've been on television for like 30 years. I know, but usually they my know. ass was covered, or if the monologue, the ass was facing the other way, and then the, the You wore the jeggings on one episode of the show, so, right. you know. But I stuff, I put stuff back there. I, I put two, uh, two, two irons that you iron clothes with back there. I had these two bulbous triangles. Would you shut what? the fuck what? up? What? You're out of control. What? You're out what? of control. You, I let you sing the whole Jub Jub Glub Glub song. You got the, the words wrong. I think I got them right. I'm going to... This has to stop. This uh, has to stop now. What we took away from this episode yeah. is that... Uh, you, you, by episode, you mean mental episode. The episode I just had yeah. where you sang the Glub Glub Jub Jub song, then Sona went on this just crazy take that I have a flat ass, <laughs> which is just not true. Super hot take, yeah. And super hot ass. <laughs> Thank you, what? Big Daddy. Come on, man. What? I like an ass That's that you can weird. hose down and that no water stays on it. It's just immediately <laughs> incredible. You know. All right. It's well, like you a know board. What? Yeah. 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 Oh, it's incredible. Yeah. It splashes back. Out. Yeah. <laughs> Is, uh, what are you doing? What are you muttering? I'm singing the Jabba's Palace song, the original one that they took out. Oh, no, good, no, no, no. good. I really That's wanted good. to hear it. Did you? Yeah. You know what? I have to move on because we have an amazing guest today. I think they can hang on. Wait they a minute. Wait. 
<gasps> Our guest has a Star Wars connection. That's right. Yes. Qui-Gon Jinn, green lightsaber. I was going to say that. Yeah, yeah, we were all going to just about to say that. And then I remembered that I was educated. All right, here we go.